AEW has revealed a new mid-card championship belt. This is the AEW All-Atlantic Championship. There is a tournament taking place, and basically a fatal four-way match will take place at Forbidden Door. My name is Zango. I'm going to give you guys my quick thoughts. First and foremost, the belt does look good. In this tournament, we have Buddy Matthews, Pack, Ethan Page, Miro, Penta, Oscuro, and Malachi Black. And, of course, we'll have two talent from New Japan, which is awesome. Hey, I really love that AEW does treat this, you know, with a lot of... Uh, a lot of passion. Obviously, the flags and the respective names uh, for the countries they represent, that's great. I love that. It's always been important to me that they have representation from other countries, and, and they're showing the flags, and I love that about AEW. I think the belt looks great. This is awesome. Amazing. Congrats to AEW for pulling off another championship belt, but we have been waiting for trios belts. We have been waiting for those trios belts since day one, and we know what this is a result of. Tony Khan introducing another belt. One, the world champion is out for a while. Two, Trio's belts aren't going to be introduced until Kenny Omega's back. Uh, you know, it's like Tony Khan had a plan three years ago, and he's willing to wait it out until Kenny comes back. That's what it feels like to me. That's what it feels like to me. And I feel like a company that is so good at telling stories has not been paying attention to what their fans want. And that is people want more stories. Another tournament, another qualifying match, another surprise debut, another announcement. Hey, I am with it. I understand what you're trying to do, but your strong suit is actually telling stories. And I think a lot of people are starting to realize AEW has gotten away from that. I am very, very happy with this belt in terms of how it looks. I'm glad that there's a mid-card belt, but timing is everything. That's my issue. Really, it's 1,000% timing. They didn't need to do this just yet. The TNT Championship has lost its prestige. Also, the World Championship kind of feels like it lost its prestige. We're not seeing the World Champion in major storylines. Hangman Page lost the belt. CM Punk is hurt. They need to they need to like refocus or something. I don't know what it is. I'm not trying to shit on AEW. They're a really, really good company when they want to be. But right now, I just feel like it's a cold spurt, and I'm not sure why. Uh, but this is the new belt. Who is going to be your pick to win? Honestly, I have no idea who it's going to be. But if I had to pick somebody, I actually hope it's a New Japan talent. I hope it's a talent from New Japan. Immediately make this belt feel important because that's what it needs in order for it to succeed. And good luck to AEW. This is going to be a real test to see how they're going to differ from WWE. You know, championship belts are supposed to feel important. AEW, ROH, New Japan. There's just so much stuff happening with AEW. It's going to be interesting to see how this goes. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below.